We got loggers in the Salmon River this morning. We, like I said in yesterday's video, we are turning a new chapter today. Said I posted on Instagram. Oh, the Sam, they're here. Come here, Dawson. What's your channel name? Getting Spooled. Getting Spooled. So Lawson, his channel name is Getting Spooled. I'll leave it down below. Lawson lives like what, half hour from here? Dawson. Dawson. I keep I saying. Lawson, yeah. yeah. Dawson I said Dawson, yeah. So I keep saying Lawson. I keep screwing it up. But he lives around a half hour from here, and uh, he's fished here all his life. I posted on Instagram looking for Roe. And he actually uh, sent me a message offering us like tips and offering to actually be kind enough to come out here and help us. So that's the deal today. We kind of waved the white flag and we called in some <laughs> some local help. Because you got what, a 10 footer three days ago? Yeah, 10 footer three days ago. 10 footer. Yeah. That's insane. Wait, show me that picture on your phone because that's really sweet. The one with the, the side imaging. The side imaging, okay. What they did is they got side imaging on their graphs and they went over this hole and they actually marked the fish on the graph. I'm showing you guys because it's just such a cool image. I can, yeah, you can zoom it in and stuff. So, so all those little marks in that big giant one was the sturgeon. So right now we're in the salmon river. We're going to catch some fresh bait, some roe, maybe some whole salmon heads. Yeah, we'll fish those today for sure. Yeah, because like the guide said, like Dawson said, not Lawson, Dawson, <laughs> it's all about bait. It really is just all about bait. So we're going to hopefully catch some really fresh bait right now and then get on some sturgeon. All right, so we got the same program going on. Pink jig, tip with some shrimp. The Dawson actually dyed pink because he's dialed in. So this is the coolest thing ever. We're fishing over there, kind of more main current stuff. In this foot of water, there are salmon spawning everywhere. Like there's hundreds of them just splashing around, swimming. Their fins are going everywhere. Like there's sharks in the water. I've never seen anything like this before. And we'll see all the splashing, all that stuff. I know it's kind of hard to see in the GoPro, but there's hundreds of salmon spawning right here. Look at this one right there. Oh, splash. There he goes. It, and they're all paired up spawning. It's just amazing to see. Look at this guy. He's almost dead. And there's all the dead ones. Once they're done spawning right here, they just kind of die. It's a crazy, crazy cycle of life. Spencer just caught one. Whoa, 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 buddy, buddy, buddy. I'm gonna grab it. Real quick, guys, before the video carries on, which you just heard that GoPro clip, for whatever reason, my GoPro decided a water got in the audio or something like that. Uh, I'm editing this video right now. Spencer and I are in like hour 29. Yeah. Maybe even hour 30 of our drive home. We're almost oh, back. We're about five hours from Minneapolis, but I'm editing this right now and there's a couple GoPro clips that are just canned. So the rest of the salmon catching, and then the clip you're about to see is me talking about the bait, and then we're just gonna jump right into the end of a fish catch because all the, the bite and all the fight is ruined for my GoPro audio. So now that I've got that out of the way, thank you GoPro. Let's get back into the video. So thanks to the help of Dawson and the help of those guys, we are now so set up with bait. Spencer, what, what do we do an inventory? What do we got? I don't know, but that is like gold. We have not had this for two days, two and a half days realistically. Um, so we have a new attitude on everything and I think the bait is the most important thing here. And um, We just weren't devoting the time to get the bait because we didn't know how big of a deal it was. Again, we know nothing about any of this. We're just flying in the seat of our pants, relying on locals like Dawson and the gentleman we just met. Um, but now we have the bait, I think we have some more confidence, so I think we're pretty dialed in now, Chris. Oh yeah. oh yeah, we're good to go. We're so dialed with bait, we got squid. I wanna chuck that salmon head, because Dawson just said that if a bite goes off on that big head, it's like at least a six or seven footer. So bait's everything, bud, eh? Everything. Bait is the key thing here. 30 minutes in, we got our first sturgeon. We got one! We got it's one. It's our first one after good bait. Uh, we're not very big, like a four footer. Nice, cool fish. We're gonna grab a couple more photos of this one and put them right back. Nice. Are they okay out of the water like this? Oh yeah. Alright, you ready Dawson? Not a big one, but we're gonna get a big one, right Dawson? Oh yeah. Alright. start. Super jacked up, look at that. Yeah, they wanna go, let her go. That's so cool. Right to the bottom she goes. Yeah, hell Beauty. yeah. Hell yeah. That's awesome. Okay, he's 
back. He's back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Dude, Spencer's got the money rod. We literally just let that one go two minutes ago. Another smaller one? We know it's small if we can move them. Because the big ones are like buses. You can't move them. Talk to me. You want the sock out? Yeah. Oh! Oh, yeah! Chris, you want this one? No. Here, take it. No, no, no. Take no. it, take it, take no, it. No, I'm not getting no charity it. fish. Here he comes. Watch us get this. Choo. These things are sweet. This is bigger than the other one, wasn't it? No, this one's smaller than the other one, I think. I'm not giving up on this. Don't break this rod right now. Just <laughs> close. We gotta be careful to not hit the prop when you were doing that. Yeah. Oh, this drag's a little loose. <laughs> Come on, buddy. <laughs> drag stop. was all the way down. It's a little loose. <laughs> came out. Oh. Came off? Yeah. Good. Yeah, good. Hey, release beside the boat. Yeah. Easy release. Yeah, exactly. We need the big one. I can feel the... Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. Yeah. That's gotta be a fish, right? Oh, yeah. What do I do? Drag him? He's just picking at it. He's picking at it. Eat it. Yeah. Come on, Tina, you fat lard. That's what sturgeon will do? Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah, those are deep holes. That's guaranteed a sturgeon. Guaranteed. What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> what do I do? Jack him. Oh. Yeah, he's still nipping. It down. The second it starts you know steady those, down. You know those two big ones? Yeah. If he did like one more. So you think he's just playing around with it? It's his chew toy right now. Yeah. Reel as you're setting the hook. Like I was just reeling, 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 and then it just jacked up. Yeah, they have really, really hard mouths. You gotta have that hook setting. So he does not have it right now. We would know. Yeah. Okay. Oh. This is chaos. <laughs> is that it? Yeah. Oh, you're on. I don't know what to look at. <laughs> They're all tipping. Yeah, that's definitely a sturgeon there. It's like a bit deeper pulls. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is so intense. <laughs> yeah. Got him? Good one. Oh, it came off. Oh, he's... Maybe not. Maybe it's swimming at me. Oh, yeah, he's swimming away. Oh, he's swimming away. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Is he coming up? Is he coming up? Oh, it came off. No. Or he's just coming up. Oh, no. He's just going he's everywhere. Doing. That's a pot. Oh, I got one, too. You got one? You got me, dude. You got me. Okay, yeah. Hey, go on the left side of him. Yeah, it got you. Okay, well... Oh, dude, I might have my own. No, uh... Dude, I think I have my own. I don't know. You might have me. I don't feel... Is he head shaking? I might be snagged on something. Yeah, I think you're on That's a nice fish, man. It might get wrapped on the anchor. That's a big fish. Chris, you gotta reel up or do something. I know, I don't do... the left side of him. Here, Dawson, can you get that bag up? Dawson, grab his rod and tell him what you think. Okay, here, I'll move no that. Here, go stand up here, Spence. Dude, I'm not sure if I have it. You're on me. Yeah. You're on me. That's a hot, dude. That's a nice fit. Yeah, we're here in this free school right now. It's a good screw, so we're about. This is a mess. Is it much heavier than the other two? Yeah, dude. Okay. I think he's wrapped. Just keep reeling up. Yeah, because you don't want to pop your hook out with that one. Just uh, go on this here. Go on this side of him. I'll grab this from you. Go on that side. Now reel up. Uh, you might be off of him. No, I'm still, I'm I'm still on. Yeah. Just keep reeling up. There you are. Dude, I think I have one. my own. Oh, you got I have my one. own, dude. <laughs> I have a tiny one, I'm telling you. Oh man. I was like, I think I got one. Get that one off. Quick, Come on. I know. Okay, I'll, uh, this is a baby. Here, you got the pliers? Yeah. Here. Here where are the pliers? Alright, thank God I'm not on yours. <laughs> I the whole time I'm like, I think I have my own. I thought he popped off like three times there. Okay. That Little dino's good. gone. Go Alright, Spence. I don't think, you wanna see him or pull the anchor? I uh, know we'll see him first. There he is. Oh there he is. Oh, yeah, he's, what the heck happened? That was weird, man. Why? That's just a hot fish. Yeah, it's not a giant, right? <laughs> it's bigger than that. 
You just release him or you want a picture or what? Yeah, dude, this hole's hot. Let's get back in. This yeah. hole's hot. See you, bud. Still good? Yeah, All right. All right, let's get back out there. This oh, is yeah, crazy. So we're re-rigging rods right now, putting on, I'm gonna put on a new bag, but Dawson's gonna throw out a salmon head. And this Going is a big fish big bait? The big fish bait. It's dripping blood. Is it? Oh yeah, that's good. Oh yeah. Yeah, he's on, he's on, he's on, he's on. Yeah. Got him. Yeah. How is he? I don't know, dude. All right, one of them. Yeah. Whatever you got going on in your system right now, that's what they want. Dawson. Yeah. Can I pull too hard? No. Like, I can't pull too hard. No. <laughs> Hell yeah, there he goes. Oh yeah, he's going. Oh, that has to be a good one. He's oh, he's coming, he's coming up, he's coming up. He's coming up, he's coming up, he's coming up. Oh, he turned. Oh, he turned. <laughs> oh, dude. Look at this. That's a good fish, man. <laughs> that's what we wanted. This is insane. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We, like, I have this real just ripping dude like it's like a goliath grouper i'm pulling on this like as hard as i possibly can and he's doing whatever he wants <laughs> whatever he wants <laughs> should we pull anchor i mean this like, fish is ripping, ripping him dude yeah this fish is ripping him river monsters dude should i tighten my drag a little bit no no it's pretty tight <laughs> yeah it's already <laughs> tight it's taking out like 100 yards what if he spools me bud well if we <laughs> then we get the anchor up <laughs> Getting schooled with my boy Dawson. <laughs> Beauty. Here he comes. Oh my. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. It's like five, maybe six, five and a half. Oh. Oh yeah. You wanna go to shore? <laughs> we can go to shore if you want. It's up to you. Oh, my. Go. Got him. Ready? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh no, you're that's done. Am I gonna lose him? Yeah. Oh, cooperating. Grab his tail. Grab his tail. <laughs> Thick tail. Got him. Hell yeah. Fence. You want to let someone else catch one? Yeah. <laughs> How is it? Heavy? Yeah. Rain's picked up a little bit. We just got another one. Small one? Yeah. Spencer's rod is dynamite. We lost one just a little bit before this, though. Yeah, that was it was a good that one. Felt good. Had him on for ten seconds, and he pulled off. Oh, there he is. <laughs> a little three, four footer. A little bit faster turn in here. Here we go. Just unhook him quick. Yeah. So where are those pliers at? There we go. Well, guys, I have a little update for you. It's been about three or four hours since that flurry of fish we caught in that hole or two. The last three to four hours has been a lot of moving and a lot of rain. I haven't been able to film at all because it's been downpouring. We just went to the truck and got this massive umbrella. So that's what's allowing me to film right now. I mean, it's really, really pouring coming down. The fishing slowed down a bit because these fish are all tide related. They really bite on a really strong outgoing tide because it keeps the river current strong. When the tide in is incoming, it slacks the current out and then, uh, fish don't bite as well so we got about maybe a half hour left of good tide or decent tide I should say and then we might run back into that salmon river to get good bait for tomorrow this camera is still super foggy I've been trying to clean it for a long time now still not cleaning so we're just gonna work with it this is what you do after fishing in British Columbia you hang everything up All of our rain jackets are so soaked. Spencer's taking a shower. Um, it, was, it was a good day. We caught a lot of fish. We wasted a lot of time this morning trying to catch some fresh bait, which we needed fresh bait, but what we should have done is spent last night trying to do it. That's what we did tonight. Uh, after fishing that spot for 20 minutes, we left and tried to go catch some more bait. We got a little bit more, but not a ton we also met up with another guy that helped us earlier in the day that was in the other boat trying to catch salmon big it's it's really confusing but basically we got a lot more bait now and tomorrow we're going to hit the river from an hour before sunrise because that's when you can fish it right yeah dawson's in the hotel room since <laughs> he's going to get dinner um i think you can fish yeah you can god my brain is frozen it is frozen 
cold. Yeah, I don't want to complain too much because you guys know, but it was cold and wet. The best tide is that falling tide from high to that slack water, and tomorrow that's going to be like 6.20 to noon, right? Just about. So we're going to try to get on the water an hour before sunrise, which is like 6.30, and really pound it hard and get that, uh, get that good bite window. So that's going to be all for today. We caught a lot of nice fish. Hopefully... Within the next two days, we'll catch a big one. Because, I mean, we're as dialed in as you can get now. All it is is a numbers game, right? Yeah. It's just, it's got to happen. One of the bites will be a big one. Yeah, one of the bites will try to pick it up, and it'll be like we're lifting up a school bus. <laughs> yeah.